Good morning, good morning. It is a soggy day in the Smoky Mountains, but that's okay. It's still beautiful. I had an okay night in the shelter. Not as good as my first night, but I can't really complain because my stuff is all dry. Well, not right now, but you know, my quilt and whatnot. I did get to surprise my friend Chris, the Ridge Runner. He showed up, not expecting me, and that was a real nice surprise. He's a retired attorney who is currently the sole ridge runner of the AT. Normally he's got two other people helping him, at least until May, but they got hired and decided this was not for them. <laughs> but it takes a lot of hard work. It's a very thankless job. Um, so big, big thank you to Chris and all the other ridge runners out there for taking care of us hikers and making sure we have what we need and get the help that we need if we need it. But um, yeah, he was uh, getting there, doing his job, counted 20 tents and one hammock at the shelter, including a packed shelter. And um, he sent me off this morning with his number in case I need anything coming up to Hot Springs since I'll have the next couple days off. And also gave me a couple goodies for trail. So that was super nice of him. He's just an all around great guy, really friendly, really kind, helpful. Just a really nice, nice guy. But I am headed off today a little early just to get some of this weather out of the way. I'm gonna shoot for Cosby Knob, which I think is 20 miles from the ice water spring shelter. But if my mood or weather dictates a shorter stop, I'll be at the Tri Knob shelter tonight. Looks like we might have a viewpoint up here, folks. Are the cars gonna break? Huh? We gonna, are we in luck? Oh, it's not looking good, y'all. No, sir. But just imagine the view. It's probably absolutely incredible. This is my first choice today. Well, not first choice, my first option, I should say. Tri Corner. It's uh, 12 miles from, from Ice Water Gap. But given that I'm killing it today so far, I'm going to push the extra almost eight ish miles to the. Uh, what knob is it? Cosby Knob? Yeah, Cosby Knob Shelter. Happening, you guys. I'm having intrusive thoughts again. If you can guess what I'm thinking, I will give you a darn tough sock that makes all the way to Damascus. <laughs> Just drop your drop your shipping address in the comments, and I'll get that right onto you. <laughs> Here. But will you stick around? Please stick around. We have a view, y'all. After six hours of rain and wind and cold, we have a view. If you guessed, Moving on past Cosby Knob to the next shelter, 
Congratulations. Make sure you leave your shipping address below so I can send you my grody old unwashed darn tough sock from Damascus. So it is 2.40. I'm just here at the split to go to Cosby Knob. I have less than seven miles to Davenport Gap. And I think it's a go. These blue skies are saying hike longer. The intrusive thoughts won. <laughs> it's a little after 5.30. Took me about 10 hours to make the 27 miles here, but I am so glad I did. Finishing off the Smokies strong. Oh, there's even a fire going. Whew. I can't believe I did it. Three days, Smokies. I left Friday, it's Sunday. I'm just outside the boundary of where you drop your permit, so I'm pretty much done, basically. But yeah, I have 15 miles tomorrow until I'm hopefully going to get a bunk at the Happy Nomads Hostel. It's uh, hosted by a couple of former through hikers So I'm hoping there's a bed for me, and then I can do some resupply in Hot Springs and kind of just have a relaxing day and then get back to it. And uh, yeah. I'm just like, I'm still on cloud nine that I did the Smokies in three days. <laughs>